I, I think the hemoglobins are one of the most unique proteins that we know of. They are present in our blood, uh, binds oxygen, of course. But uh, what's quite amazing is that we don't just have them in our body. I mean, we also find them in bacteria, in plants. The genome of sugar beet recently became available, meaning that we then got access to all possible genes that are present in the sugar beet. When we started to look on, on this genome, I mean, we actually found a handful of hemoglobin genes. To our big surprise, they were very robust and stable proteins, much more stable than our own hemoglobins in our body. Our strategy so far, that has been mainly to clone these genes and insert them into bacteria. That facilitates very much their expression and later purification. You, you really see a, a massive need in society for, for blood alternatives and, and therefore you, you see that there, there, there must be something done to, to handle the situation.